Hello Alex's EDC Army and welcome to Alex's Knives and Such with a Such Stands for EDC gear. Today we have a knife versus with the uh, Kaiser Y-A-C-H-T, which is Yacht, versus the Kaiser A-M-I-C-U-S, which is Amicus. It's a button lock and a flipper tab. This is... A flipper tab and a liner lock. Let me look at this um, Amicus real quick and see. I believe they're both um, 9CR18 MOV steel. Let's um, start with the uh, yacht. It's um, in JG10 with a two position clip left or right. But it's right tip up right now. It, um, what else? No backspacer, no, uh, no lanyard slot. So you probably couldn't put a lanyard, but if you're so, if you're more of a lanyard person, then you would tie it to the standoff, but you really don't need it at all. The action, centering is good. No blade play. You would hold it like this, or like this, or like this. It has grooves here for your fingers, so it's a, it's more comfortable, and it's squared off at the end. So do I like it? Yes. Let's see the action again. You do that one. Really nice. Then we have... This is also a stonewash blade. And it's really nice shape and really good in hand for a smaller knife. Then we have the um, Kaiser Amicus. All blacked out. Button lock. Two-way clip. Tip up right or left. It's tip up right on right now. It um, has a lanyard hole. So you are good for that if you're a lanyard fan. And if it's too small, you would... Be able to have a lanyard to help you get your pinky finger on. You would hold it like this, like this, and I would even say, um, if you so needed to, and you wanted to have control and you had good grip, you could do this. It it flips with the flipper tab, which is jammed. This flipper tab, let's see on the yacht, it's not jammed, but it's jammed on the um amicus. And look at the um, button lock action. Wow, it just goes in without having to do any effort. Look. Centering is good. Let's do a close size comparison together. They're about the same size and close length. Now in O, let's say um, overall length, let's see. Tip to tip is how I do it. So let's see. They're about the same size. Okay. Let's do the size comparison with the O knife Beagle. Bigger than both. And the Blade HQ exclusive real steel G5 Metamorph. All blacked out too. Bigger than both. Well, it's really good knives, so let's do a cut test, starting with the um, Amicus. Sure we don't show no addresses on these packages that we're cutting. Yep, this has a lot of tape, so it's going to be harder to cut, so you can't go down with it. But the push cut is good. Yep, the Amicus cuts good. Uh, 
Now let's do the yacht. Cuts really well. Let me go this way. Cuts really well. So the yacht and the amicus cut really well. Let's see how I can how this works left-handed. In a, in a few seconds, we can check how it is left-handed. With the um starting with the um yacht. Okay, kind of different in, in the left hand, but not bad. So I wouldn't say it's 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 not usable. It is closing it. Just different holding it this way. I don't know. Usually it's not, but it's okay. It's not different that it's bad. Okay. Now we're going to do the um, amicus. Hmm. This is not bad in the left hand. I like it. Okay. And then let's close it. Okay. Good knife too in the left hand. You can find them on Kaiser's site and probably other knife websites, but they're in the, their budget category because they are 9CR18 MOV blade steel and G10 scales. I don't know the exact prices, but I don't think they're relatively expensive. So I'd say no more than $63, but probably less, most, like, most likely less than $60 before shipping on Kaiser's website. <clears throat> on Kaiser's website. So yeah. Good knives. Whichever one you like, you can't go wrong. This blunt lock is very, very smooth. And good. And this well, liner lock is good too. Let's do the rating now. Let's start with the um Kaiser Amicus. You feel this a little bit because it right here you can see the oh sorry right here you can see it has like a little raised area but otherwise it's not bad so i give the kaiser amicus on the low side an 8.8 .8 to an to an 8 point yeah an 8.8 .8 .8 to a 9.0 and on the high side Wait, no, let's redo that. On the low side, I give it a 9.3 to a 9.4. On the high side, a 9.6 to 9.7. It's good. It might be small for some people, but it works with a little bit of raised area on the handle scales. But it's good. For the action, I'd give it a 12 out of 10. That's the Kaiser Amicus. Now the Kaiser Yacht. Kaiser Yacht. This is a little raised, so it's not as comfy. But this part is. Okay, on the low side, I give this Kaiser Yacht a 9.1, 9.2. Oh, wait, 9.2, 9.3. That's what I would give it, a 9.2, 9.3. And on the high side, I would give it a 9.5, 9.6. It's really good. Now for the action, let's show you. The action, I give it a 9.8. It's really good. So whatever Kaiser, whichever one of these Kaisers you go with, you won't have a bad choice. The Kaiser Amicus button lock, the Kaiser Yacht, liner lock, both 9CR18 MOV. This is all blacked out Amicus and stone wash blade on the yacht. Let me know what you think of these knives in the comment section below. And if you have them, how do they work for you? 
Like, comment, share, subscribe, even dislike. Have a great day. Be safe. Subscribe to my channel for more to come. Look out for the guy girl to your left. Look out for the guy girl to your right. Hashtag be up. Hashtag DSKFS. Choose love, not hate. Enjoy your friends, your family, your pets, your army food, your music, your video games. And remember to use your sharp blades. Bye.